guys. Uh, sorry I have been MIA for the past couple months. Um, for those who don't know me, my name is Jacqueline. I am a nutritionist and personal trainer. Um, I am also completely plant-based. Um, so I, I wanted to share my, my transition story with you guys um, just really briefly and some things that have helped me with that transition. Um, the biggest reason I decided to go plant-based was because I was experiencing a ton of inflammation. Um, just feeling like a lot of heaviness in my body when I would get up in the morning. Found it really hard to like get started when I was trying to work out. Um, you know, I get super tired throughout the day. I felt like I needed to nap all the time. Um, I felt really like lethargic and it just, it wasn't fun. I was having a lot of digestive issues. I was bloating every time I ate. Um, I was constipated all the time. It just, it wasn't comfortable. Um, so I just wanted, like I said, to share with you guys some things that helped me through the transition. Um, and hopefully um, they'll be able to help you. Um, all these products you can actually get at Vitamin Shop. I am a Vitamin Shop nutritionist. So if you guys have questions, please feel free to ask. Um, and I will talk a little bit about the brands and what's the ingredients in the products and things like that. But these four things have really been staples for me. Um, and I, I hope they help you guys if you're trying to transition into being plant-based or if you're just looking for a really clean product because um, most of them are non-GMO, USDA certified organic. Um, these two right here are certified vegan as well for those um, who are completely plant-based like myself. And when I say plant-based guys, like I mean I eat no animal product, like no poultry, meaning chicken, turkey, whatever, no pork, no red meat, no fish, no shellfish, um, no, absolutely no dairy because I'm dairy intolerant. I'm also gluten intolerant. So no gluten for me. Um, not that it's animal based because it's not. Um, but yeah, so I, I don't say vegan because I feel like it's associated with a specific lifestyle and I don't feel I completely fit that, that mold. Um, so I just wanted to specify that. Um, but I am all about environmental sustainability, um, you know, very against animal cruelty, um, and just supporting our, our local food distributors, local farmers, and things like that. So I decided to, uh, like I said, I decided to start this because I was experiencing a lot of systemic inflammation, so like full body inflammation, um, and I just needed to like change something up, right? So these four products really have have helped me through that so i'm gonna walk you guys through it and when i say inflammation guys i mean i was like oh i was going through a lot um but oh my gosh i hate when i lose my train of thought but let's go through through the products um so a lot of oh before i do that so a lot of people tend to veer away from going plant-based um especially if they've tried it only for a short period of time and a short period of time guys is like a month two months like a couple weeks um because you don't give yourself time for your gut microbiome to adjust to the dietary change that you're making like if you become used to doing something like change is difficult right so think about that with your gut microbiome or your gut bacteria they're used to you eating a very specific way, so they've become very accustomed to modulating and um, processing foods and nutrients that you're taking in, you know, in a very specific way. So if you change what you're feeding them or what you're feeding yourself, you have to give them an adjustment period, right? And for them, gut bacteria, I mean, it depends on the individual, but it could take a month, it could take six months. It, it all depends on the person and, and how drastic of a change you're, do, you're making. For me, I'm very black and white, so I literally went from eating animal protein all the time, like every meal, to completely not, and then increasing my fruit and vegetable intake like crazy. So I did experience water retention. Um, my body got a little inflamed just because it was healing itself, right? Like I'm sure I did a lot of damage with eating a lot of animal-based products, um, and I can go into the research in another post. So my body was healing itself and I, I knew I had to give myself that that time. So a couple of products that I use, um, this is a probiotic. Um, the, I'll put all the brands um, and where you can, where I purchased them from down below. Um, this is a pro bio care probiotic. It's 50 billion, it's women specific. So this will really help with digestion. It'll help with your mood. It'll help with any constipation that you're having. 
Um, so this is a really great product. A probiotic is something I recommend definitely um, if you're transitioning into a plant-based lifestyle or if you're transitioning into a different eating pattern, um, probiotics are super helpful. Um, if you want to know more about dosage and timing and stuff, comment below and I will respond to you. Next is kombucha. So Kavita is the brand that I use just because it's the lowest sugar brand that I could find. It's USDA organic. Um, they use apple cider vinegar. Um, they use some lactobacillus bacteria, um, but it tastes really great. Um, it's not super vinegary. And kombucha guys is meant to be drank like in small amounts. So you should really only be drinking like two ounces at a clip. Um, I was doing two ounces three times a day. Um, or two to three times a day with meals and I found that it was super helpful. I mean sometimes I, I would drink a whole one but over like the course of the day. Um, so kombucha is is really helpful. Now next two products are from a brand that I am like obsessed with. Um, the brand is Aura Organics. They are completely plant-based, certified vegan, non-GMO, USD Organic, they've got all these great certifications. The brand is all about environment, environmental sustainability. Um, they're just a fantastic brand. You have to check out their website. I will post it below. Um, I also um, have featured them on my social media, so feel free to check them out. But two products that I've been using a lot, um, one is Trust Your Gut. So this is gonna be a pre and probiotic formula. So prebiotic is like the food for your probiotics. So like your healthy gut bacteria. So this has a really good blend of lactobacillus and bifidobacterium, a couple different strains of each. Um, so it's really going to help with digestion, absorption of nutrients, um, and decreasing like that bloating, that flatulence, that constipation that you're experiencing. Um, the sources of the prebiotic, which is a plant-based fiber is going to be um, Jerusalem artichoke um, and organic tapioca, which is really great. Um, there's only 30 calories, um, 7 grams of carb, 5 of which are fiber, which is awesome. So check this out. Really good. And this is the apple and raspberry flavor. Guys, this tastes so good. Um, they also have a lot of great recipes on their website um, by um, one of their founders, Chef Ron. He is an amazing, amazing person. The whole team is amazing, so make sure you check them out. Um, next product um, is not really so much for digestion, um, but it's the Aura Organic Renewable Energy. It's something that I use um, as a pre-workout and just to boost my energy a little bit throughout the day if I'm feeling a little sluggish. Um, definitely in the beginning of the transition, it was very difficult for me and I was having like low energy because my body was healing itself. So energy was being deviated to other areas. So yeah. So this renewable energy powder has been instrumental. Um, again, there's only 35 calories. Um, it's really, really low calorie. Um, they've got a great electrolyte blend in here, good amount of vitamins and minerals. Um, so just a really, really, really great product. Um, I just want to make sure I'm mentioning everything. Oh, so what makes it a great pre-workout guys is the nitric oxide blend, which is pomegranate and beet. Um, so nitric oxide is what in increases the oxygenation in your blood, which, um, increases blood flow to your muscle tissue, which gives you a really, uh, well, can improve your strength, right? When you're working out. So this is something that's really nice. Um, for pre-workout if you're looking for something more natural, but also um, if you're just looking for more energy. So if you guys have any questions um, about what I've talked about in this video or about any of the products, please feel free to comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. And thank you so much for stopping by. Um, quick physique check. No bloat. <laughs> Bye guys, thanks so much for stopping by.